It wasn't always easy for Lincoln grad Jermaine Hamlin. He has the tools, but it took him a while to put them all together. He chose prep school over college after his senior year of high school. Brett Barron's talked with Hamlin recently to find out why that's the right path for him. Jermaine Hamlin has the one thing you can't teach, size. At 6 foot 10, he stands taller than most on the EYBL circuit, playing alongside and against some of the nation's top recruits as part of the Bradley Beal elite. Playing with these good kids, I get a lot of looks from other coaches because they come to watch them. You know, if I just show out before, then I better get some looks from them too. Hamlin graduated from Lincoln in May, but decided to reclassify to the class of 2020. The honorable mention All-State pick will attend Link Year Prep in Branson, Missouri, as he tries to improve his stock on the recruiting trail. He currently holds offers from Fort Wayne, Eastern Illinois, along with North and South Dakota. The next step is for me to start playing hard, you know, out there, you just got to play hard and run the floor and all that good stuff, and just try to get, do as much as I can on the both sides of the floor. Hamlin has come a long way since getting cut from tryouts from his eighth grade team. He made the squad his freshman year, the first time he ever played organized basketball. As a senior, he helped the Railers make a run to the sectional title game, averaging about 15 points and eight rebounds per game. The progress that he's made over the course of those four years have been, uh, in my 43 years of coaching, the, the, by far the most that I've ever had a player improve. So, um, you know, he's still probably, he's got a lot of work to do, but uh, the sky's the limit. He's only going to get better. Uh, two or three more years of playing, uh, the, the skill level that he has, it, it will be uh, sky high. Hamlin says he also wants to gain more weight, hoping to get up to 250. He'll have plenty of time to pack on the pounds before he enrolls in college this time next year. Reporting in Indianapolis, Brett Barron's WCIA 3 Sports.